Hello all. So, not as loud today with the waves. This is, let me show, can it, no. This is my view. That's what I'm staring at. So I'm out on one of these wave breakers. So what you guys were just looking at, that's in front of the beach. The beach goes for quite a while. And they have these little, these strips of rock that are out there and they use it to make it to where it doesn't really matter how bad it is out there. The beach is easy enough to hang out on. So, I can't stream make videos, right? Well, I've actually been busting ass for the last couple days working on Dragon Quest on the computer because um, on Sunday, uh, the main guy that I'm working with here, he's been very helpful in a lot of different things, but he, I told him what happened with the phone, and so he sent a text, got a reply within five minutes, okay, your phone's unlimited now. Sweet. So I'm back to higher yet, not necessarily reliable speeds, and open internet. I don't have anything blocked, so... I'm going to put this video up, but when I get back inside, when I get to the room, after doing that, I'm going to work on Dragon Quest. I have one more section left, and then I will be at the same point that I was in the PlayStation version before I left. And I'm going to try to stream, so you guys might see that soon. In general, um, I'm just probably going to talk about being here less because I don't want to sound bitchy. I did that a lot. I complained about the channel a lot. I went through that phase and then I grew the fuck up. Nothing I say is going to sound too meaningful or grand, but it's, it's everything together. And so, the short of it is, I'm not enjoying myself here, so what? I'm here. That's not going to change. I'm not going to stay here two or three weeks longer than planned. That's no longer on the table. So, I'm just going to go back at the end of this month. Or, I'm sorry. At the end of the month that I was sent here, which is still about two and a half weeks away. I still haven't figured out what I'm going to do passing through London this next time. I'm going to send an email out about that tonight and ask what they think I should do because it's kind of in a weird situation with how they pay travel. If I stay in the ho or in the airport the whole time, I think I'm supposed to keep that on the clock because it's supposed to be door to door when you leave the hotel to when you get home leave the home to get to the hotel when you leave the hotel to get to the hotel that's how you're supposed to track it so if I don't leave the hotel or if I don't leave the airport I'm technically traveling that whole time which feels weird but at the same time getting paid for being on the plane is weird anyway so I don't want to do that though I would like to go out get a hotel get a dinner even if I'm not gonna be there for very long I'm not going to get a full night's rest. I don't care. I want to go to London, not just breathe the air and sit in the airport. So, uh, other than that, I did get my rental car upgraded, which is great. I was refueling every three trips from work to home uh, and back. Every three days I had to fill that little Kia Canto up. But now they put me in an Impreza, which sucked. There was a 
fucking Peugeot right next to it. Again, I wanted to drive something that I really don't have the chance to drive back home, but whatever. I'm in a new car, it's got a much bigger tank. I'm happy. It's also got this stupid little fucking device in there that... The car itself doesn't have one of those front-end sensors that a lot of newer cars in the States have that yell at you if you're too close. So they installed one. It's this little device that's over in the, next to the windshield, so I turned that off because it doesn't do shit in this country. They will cut you off. They will get right in front of you. It's not your fault. You aren't following too closely. You just get cut off in this country. So that thing was going off way too much. So at least that, that that's good. I want to see a movie here. I saw a movie in Japan. I want to see a movie here in this country. Hell, maybe I'll try to see a movie in London as part of my night out. But, because uh, I keep all my stubs, so I still have my stub from Japan. I want to see Venom. Venom should be here. I have to get out of out of the water now. Anyway, so Venom should be out here somewhere. So I should see that. I don't even know what'll be out by the time I go through London, but I'll look. Maybe I will see a British film. Hope they have subtitles. I might need those. Exus and I were watching. We attempted to watch. Uh, Kay Beckinsale did a. Jane Austen movie, uh, Love and Friendship, I think it was called, and I was tired as fuck that night. I had just got back from a trip or something, and we put it in, and I made the joke that I need subtitles for this. They were talking in, you know, that older British talk and doing so very quickly. All, all of them were just very skilled at being able to talk. I mean, she's a fast talker anyway when you hear her on uh, interviews and such. But everyone was doing it, and I couldn't follow it. I know it was English, but it was like three layers of English just crammed into a sandwich, and I, I, I couldn't follow. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll, I'll see what's showing around there when I pass through. Kind of wish I was there for more than 12 hours, because then it wouldn't make the choice easy. Go get a damn hotel. But also, now you can do stuff. So that's a short update. I hope to see you guys again in a few hours when I hope to be able to go live. We will see. Uh, I don't have, uh, Fussbot won't get up. I need Exus to send me a file that Fussbot references on my desktop, except I don't know where it is. It's, it's wherever the program put it. So I'm gonna have to help her find that and send it out to me. So Fussbot won't be active for the first stream if I get to do it tonight. Tomorrow, maybe, we'll see, so. That's about it. See you guys later.